<laughs> like this is fine? Okay, jump. Eh, Deku? Oh, Kachan, you're here. How do I look? I'm trying to replicate Miriko style, and also, and I study all night the pose, and... You look beau... <gasps> Midoriya, we are ready for the group picture. Yes, I'm coming! <clears throat> Alexa, add eggs to the shopping list. I'm adding legs to the shopping list. No, cancel! Alexa, add eggs to the shopping list. Alexa, can you add eggs to the shopping list? Hi, Izuku, good morning. How are you today? I'm adding eggs to the shopping list for you. <laughs> what the hell, stupid Alexa? I'll kill you! Sorry, I can't help you. <laughs> now the day bleeds into nightfall, and you're not here to get me through it all. I let my guard down, and then you pull the rug. I was getting kind of used to being someone you loved. Please, I can't listen to this song anymore! I can hear him sobbing. We should do something. I'm home. Welcome back, nerd. You're late. How was your day? It wasn't that good. I didn't save a girl that was in danger. She made it thanks to Kirishima-kun, but it is so frustrating. And on top of that, a journalist said I'm not a good hero, that I'm sexist. I was losing it. I'm not good enough, I know, but sexist? Now people is tweeting that I'm not all might. Hey, nerd, stop! First of all, who is that dump that is saying you're not a good hero? You're the fucking best hero I know on the entire earth! You care about everyone, even the smallest sand! I know how much you put yourself on side to help others. Who says different is blind? <laughs> now stop ugly crying, nerd! I'm gonna make you the best Katsudon ever! I'm so glad to have you, Kanchan! <laughs> Kanchan is not for romantic stuff, so for Valentine's Day, I went hiking with him. Here we are! Do you like it, Kanchan? <laughs> Kanchan is hugging me? You're right for once, nerd. Valentine's Day is not that bad. Oh, Kanchan! Now, let me eat my favorite chocolate. <laughs> Couldn't imagine a better Valentine's Day. <laughs> now, we'll repair the secret ingredient. Is the secret ingredient love? No, you're embarrassing, nerd. It's buttermilk. Oh. Love isn't a real ingredient. Oh, my mom usually puts love as her secret ingredient. Sure it is! That's what I put in your coffee, and you seem to really like it. <clears throat> Gee, Ciro, it's her, it's her, it's really something. You been looking through my old hero costume drawings again? Yes, I commissioned it myself. Of course, I'd hoped it would be a wedding present, but... Come on, Ciro, don't start. Look, you're not still sore because I didn't fall for any of the other royals, are you? Oh wait, it isn't me alone. The entire kingdom wants to see you happily settle down with the right one. And okay, maybe Monomo wasn't the best candidate, but Kendo and Tetsu Tetsu... If Kendo and Tetsu Tetsu were in love with each other, you mean. The right one is out there. Someone tough, cool, manly, who's passionate and determined and... And we'd be equals. We won't just be any old boring couple, we'd be the best, number one, and nothing less than it. <laughs> They're out there somewhere. I just, I just haven't found them yet. Believe me, Ciro, when I find them, I'll know. Without a doubt, it'll just BAM! Hit me, like lightning. Hurricane to come in, stand fast, secure the rigging. Whoa, the wind's all of a sudden on the move here! Ah, Bakugo! Paralyze! <laughs> Denki! Jump, Denki! Come on, boy, jump! You can do it, Denki! Hijiro! Hey! Oh my god! Powder! Boom! He can't be dead! Look at him! He doesn't even have a scratch on him after that explosion! It's hard to say. I, I can't make out a heartbeat! But look! I think he's breathing. His chest is moving and there's air coming out of his mouth. That's normal for humans, right? Oh, you have a scar. I wonder what in the world is out there that would give you a scar, tough guy. Kachan? You idiot, risking your life for a dog. And you still refuse to go down. That means you're stupidly strong. You make one hell of a hero, Kirishima Ijiro. <laughs> <laughs> hey, buddy, good to see you're safe. Ijiro, oh, hey. You really delight in these sadistic strains on my blood pressure, don't you? <laughs> You, it's you! Wait, come back! 
Zero, a boy. There was a boy and he rescued me. He was smiling and laughing and he had the most beautiful laugh, like a hyena cackle. Okay. Oh, Adro, I think you've swallowed a bit too much seawater. Off we go. Come on, Denki. Wherever you are, I hope we can meet again, my hero. I know you're the one. Bam, just like lightning. <laughs> what would I give to live where you are? What would I pay to stay here beside you? What would I do to see you smiling at me? Where would we walk? Where would we run? If we could stay all day in the sun, just you and me, and I could be part of your world. I don't know when, I don't know how, but I know something's starting right now. Watch and you'll see. Someday, I'll be. <laughs> hey, I'm here. You know the situation, so I'll make it quick. Of course. I was thinking about it much. I will teach you and train you as much as I can and have in my power, but I want to see if you are worth it, so don't disappoint me. First, we'll start with the written part. It'll be hard, probably because we don't have much time. If you went to Shinketsu like you said, then it shouldn't be that hard. You'll need to repeat what you already learned and just add a few new things. Then we'll start with training. And I'll repeat, don't you disappoint me. <laughs> Come. Okay. So we are starting with written part, then we'll go to physical. Got it. So, about that. There's another kid I'm giving private lessons to, mostly training. You don't mind, do you? He's a little grumpy. No, I don't. That's fine, too. I'll talk to him about it as well. Anyway, we need to start as soon as possible. Go home and study. I'll contact you in five days where to meet, and when so you can take tests. Okay. Why five days? Damn, I have a lot to study. When I have time, I'll help you. Also, I'll cover places you usually cover, so just focus on this and have no worries. Thanks. Gotta focus. Focus. Just gotta focus on studying. Sir, please stay calm and don't force yourself to move yet. I'm going to get the doctor. Doctor! Patient! I'm coming. How, how long has it been? Someone! Go! Go! Why does someone always have to die? Why does it always start like this? <laughs> Not a scratch. <laughs> I went through him. He has multiple quirks, that's for sure. Could he be sent by all for one? I don't remember him from anywhere with that power of his. It would be impossible to not notice him. It looks uncontrollable and makes a lot of mess. So he wasn't arrested or anything. Maybe he was in a coma all this time. This should be his first appearance in public unless he had different quirk or quirks before. He seems pretty clueless though. And I can guess he wasn't targeting me. He's just defending himself. But those people he killed. That face! Ugh! Whatever he's doing, he's doing it for his own satisfaction. Uh, I... I don't... I... I don't... Uh, no... All I know is it's hungry... He's going through the window! Please stop, you'll get killed... I don't want to kill for no damn reason! I just... think it's stupid... And what would you do if I leave you alone now? I just go my way then... Hey, Natalie, look! I've worked on a new style of cataclysm. I call this Cataclaws. Isn't it cool? Mm. Come on, Natalie, I require attention. <sighs> Stop. <sighs> I told you I have work to do. Mr. Regress counts on me, and I'm the only one who can do it. So stop trying to distract me, because between you and my duty to Gabriel, you stand no chance. Oh. I'm such a fool. Of course I can't manipulate her feelings that easily. That's exactly what I like about her. Oh, Natalie, what am I doing? Can I sit next to you while you finish? I guess. <sighs> Shadow Noir, I... Don't worry about me. Just finish your work. We will have plenty of time after. Later. <sighs> okay, I'm done. Now we can do whatever you wanted to do. Great, then. <laughs> Come on, let's go to my room before Gabriel sees you. <laughs> Even later. <laughs> Thank you for understanding earlier. Sure, but are you okay with all the work your boss puts you through? Gabriel can be a little hard to work with. He's meticulous, hardworking, passionate. 
He's also someone who puts his whole soul into his goals. But since Emily, his wife died in an accident, it feels like he lost a part of it. And I need to help him because I would do anything to see him smile again. He doesn't deserve you, Natalie. <laughs> Shadow Noir? You shouldn't have this burden on you. He's being selfish. I remember you lost your life too, but... That man. Someone should teach him a lesson. Hey, don't go after him, okay? Shadow Noir? Could you bring us coffee, Natalie? Sure, sir. Gabriel is such in a better mood today. Everything feels lighter. I'm back at... <laughs> Good morning, Natalie. <sighs> what have you done? Oh, I had to, sweetheart. After all, he was between us. <sighs> just... just a nightmare. He already left. Let's see what he wrote this time. My Natalie, I would like to apologize for yesterday. I felt your pain and I can assure you that whatever problem Gabriel Legress has with exploiting you will be dealt with. <gasps> I can't let this happen. Murder! Murder! Huh? Meanwhile, what an idiot I have been yesterday. <laughs> I'll stop trying to push Natalie away. She's still my friend after all. Bam! I also have to replace that desk. <sighs> go? Go where? Power? Let's go, Denji! Whoa! Wait, this isn't how it's supposed to... <laughs> Goodbye, Makima! So, the last film in my Chainsaw Man series just finished showing. The title spoils the ending, but eh, I like it. Dead Explosion Makima. They're all standing up now. Let's go see their reactions. I'm actually pleasantly surprised by the whole thing. The beach scene was really well done, and I think my acting was pretty good. My death scene was also really emotional. It's just... Why did Makima have to die like that? It was amazing! Especially the explosion at the end when it... Yeah, the explosion was definitely the best part! Hey, I'm the one getting interviewed here! You already had your own movie! I always figured that Makima would be the final villain. She was weird from the start. She also acts creepy all the time. I know how they are survived for so long! But I think that explosion at the end was really sudden. No offense, I still think the movie was good. That explosion at the end was so bad. Why did you end the movie like that? It was alright, I guess. Thanks for the booze. I think that explosion was quite cheap. It felt very anticlimactic. I don't know why you added lesbian sex scenes in the movie, but I enjoyed filming them. <laughs> uh, Makima? The movie's over. You can stop acting like that. From a technical standpoint, it was good. I would have changed the ending now. So, most people didn't like the ending of Dead Explosion Makima. There were a bunch of explosions in Bomb Girl, but no one complained about that. It doesn't make any sense. I just wanted the ending to be shocking and memorable. I'm gonna go see Power. Tenji, I've been waiting for you. Why are you sad? I didn't like the ending. Come on, who cares about that? I mean, it's your movie. It's how you wanted it to end, right? You shouldn't let others control how you live your life. Losing yourself like that can kill the people that you love. Mm. Wait, what are you even talking- And I already told you this, but that explosion was really cool! You really made it go out with a bang! You know what? Huh? Yeah, you're right! I get to choose how I end my own stories! I have full control! And that explosion was cool! See? I told you! My super smart saved you again! <laughs> I can't remember the last time I laughed like that. <laughs> what was that you said earlier? Which part? Oh yeah. Wait a second. Go out with the... <sighs> <gasps> well, well, look at you. Well, your bones. I figured you're getting older. You need as much sleep as you can. Went hunting without me, huh? Anyways, I almost didn't recognize you. Looks like you're starting to get serious. Uh, you think so, huh? Because today is... well... Yeah, it's your birthday. Congratulations, you little punk. Thanks, but you wrote down, didn't you? Now then. Take the day off. It's your big day, so I'm drinking at the Hootie's Bar. Mm -hmm. You promised to tell me about them! You only ever said something really bad happened! Bits and pieces, but that's only when you're wasted! Every year! Why can't I just get a straight answer? That's not fair! Yeah, I gave it some thought and decided. Maybe next year. 
It's too soon. You may not understand it's for your own good. Just say it! They threw me away! They left! Cause I was born, right? If they're out there, it's the only logical reason. Just tell me! Punch! I get it. You're pissed. You have every right to be. But don't you dare speak of your parents that way! They would never leave their child! Then why? Where are they? All I want is to know who I am! Why? Why is that so wrong to you? Huh? Just forget it. Hey, wait just a sec. I'm taking the day off, like you said. Nice going, fool. If only... If you were here instead of me, you'd know what to do. Why so sad, Pops? <laughs> it's not like you at all! Just take a deep breath. As long as you live and breathe, you can always try again. So it's okay. Don't sulk too much. I can try again? Even someone like me? What do you mean? You could do anything! Know why? Because you're the strongest! You've always had it in you. You can do this, know why? When it comes to hunting or family, you never run from a fight. Even after so long, you've always been spot on. How I miss both of you. You must still be pissed at me, thinking back. Hmm. Let's hurry, we can still make it to the final selections. Yeah, I wonder how many the Master will pick this time. This should be good. No, don't tell me. It started without me! Of all freaking days! I lost track of time this morning. Damn, shortcut it is! This has been a sight to behold! Boy, what a show! What a fight! The Seeker Trials have come to a climax. You can always count on the Lions Guild to put on a great show. Wind type, Erica Carter. Water type, Ariana Hino. Lightning type, Logan Slade. Earth type, Ken Ardman. It appears we're short of finalists, but who cares? Let's move on to the grand finale. Elder, was it necessary to make a grand spectacle? Ho ho ho. It's fun to shake things up. Just relax. If you say so, Master. So much new talent and potential. This is exciting. Sir? Wait, people. The Master of the Guild has chosen! I have decided to welcome not one, but all of you to our home. So be ready. Show everybody what you can do. Yes, sir! Yes, sir! Yes, sir. Yes, sir! Then I welcome you all, members and students, to the Scarlet Lions Guild! And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen! Jeez, I can't believe we all made it! But I'm glad! Now we can all be partners! Oh yeah, you're really strong! Oh yeah, looks like it. And thanks. I think? He sucks. He looks like he's gonna be a buzzkill, man. But at least there's some girls on the team. Master, I agree they have potential before this year. Mm -hmm. But of course, a faith old friend just trusts in the next generation. And maybe, just maybe. Mm -hmm. Sir? Go. Do you feel that malicious aura in the air? Ah, uh, yes. I sense it too. This could be bad. We must ensure the safety of the people. You're still a bit slow, my boy. <laughs> Listen, all of you! We have an emergency, hence your first mission. We of the Lions Guild will protect and evacuate civilians out of harm's way. We'll notify the city guard about the possible threat. Understood? Yes, sir! Yes, sir! Yes, sir! Yes, sir! What you doing way up here? Hmm? All your aura. Could have sworn I taught you that. How'd you find me? Anyways, I thought you were going to the guild. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. I was too late. The fireworks are almost over. So, you're just gonna quit? What's the point? Someone like me could never. I'm just a kid with anger issues. Anger issues, huh? Yeah, I agree. But that anger. It's more like, once you care about something, there's no stopping you. Huh? Plus, stories go that the Guardian Saver was a kind, strong, and passionate person. That's still your goal, isn't it? Listen, I was thinking, I can call in an old favor. Maybe I can get you in the guild. Uh, you can do that? You know, for your birthday gift, I mean. And, well, about earlier. We can talk about our family's past when you want. <laughs> really? You're not drunk this time, are you? <laughs> no, not right now. <laughs> Alright, let's go with that. What was that? Len, you stay here, in. Those people need help! Hey, I said wait! Don't worry, I got this! Stupid boy! I told you to wait! Huh? Your mom... This 
pressure feels just like that damn night. Oh, <laughs> ah! Get away! <laughs> <laughs> it's been too long since we sacked a human town. How about we raise a little hell? That was your idea, so have fun. <laughs> Closer. This sucks. How did I get stuck with a guy? Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> yeah, I figured the guild would clean up. I see some newbies too. Nope. You seem to know your way around our humble city. Whoa, the Elder Master! Please don't kill me! No need for violence! Honest, I am! I'm just a tagalon. I'm not here to fight anybody! <laughs> you don't seem to be lying. You must be a skilled young man. Oh no, I have much to learn, honestly. And yet something about you is on edge. A deeper truth underneath all that honesty. Hmm. If you don't seize this attack, I'm afraid I'll have to take you in. <laughs> You're so mean, master! I come all this way to see the sights, sounds, smells! It's that big brute that's breaking stuff! He gets cranky stuck in the house all day! He's just a big baby! I mean, no harm, but fine. I know when I'm not wanted. I hope you're happy, master! You're a mean old man! Raj's technique, eh? Such intense heat for his age. He erased his presence, but he's still around. Mysterious and frightening boy, indeed. Phew, a close one. He would have seen right through me. Stupid Roth! I'll kill him later for putting me through that. But still, I wonder how he's doing. Quickly, join the others evacuated! Yes, thank you, we will. <laughs> and now for a... <sighs> She's sleeping so soundly. I don't want to wake her up. <laughs> A little while later. The history of animation. <laughs> hey, welcome back. Huh? We're at my place already? What happened? You fell fast asleep, but I was able to get this much done. What? You really didn't have to. You could have woke me up. Trust me, Klutz. Nothing was going to wake you up. Do you feel better? Mm, a little. Here, let me help. Are you sure? Yeah, let's glue this together. Touch. <laughs> Sorry! Sorry! Mm -hmm. Let go. Uh, uh, if I fell asleep in the car, then... Yeah, I gotta carry you. I hope that was okay. You were just sleeping so beautifully. I mean, soundly. I didn't want to disturb you. Uh, that's embarrassing. I also didn't know you snore. Okay, now you're just making stuff up. Nope, all of Paris could hear you. <laughs> just shut up and help me with this. An hour later. Man, a last minute photo shoot. I gotta run. Okay, thanks for all the help, Adrian. We should be done in no time. Mm-hmm. I'll see you tomorrow, Marinette. Please take care of yourself. Aw, oh, dang it. What's the matter? These markers are drying up. I need to go get more. Now where's my jacket? I thought you were going to talk more about Adrian. What? There's nothing to say. We're just working on the project. You only take off your favorite jacket when you're very comfortable. Uh, it got hot in here from working too hard. Ah, there it is. I think Marinette doesn't want to admit that she enjoyed Adrian's company. Going to the photo shoot. Why can't I stop thinking about her? Meanwhile, somewhere in space. Error, 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 error. System failure? This can't be! I need to land on the nearest planet fast or else I'll end up like a gooey pile of cannon bear! Ah! Hey, Gonchon! I got you this custom t-shirt printed at the print shop where I get all my shirts from! I think it would suit you! Oh, wow, thanks, Taku. But I think you misspelled sweetie. No, I didn't. Mm. I feel like this is karmic justice for all the years I bullied you, and in all honesty, this feels terrible. I'm so sorry. Come on, All Might! We have to meet up with Gran Torino later! In a while, after I beat young Sarah over here on this game he showed me called Fortnite! Um, All Might, you won't be able to beat Sarah Kun. Huh? Why not? Cause this isn't even a controller, it's a calculator! But at least you look like you got a high score! More cheese, mon ami? Seems like you really like it! Yes, I love all kinds of cheese! I love Gouda, Cheddar, Brie, Larson, or whatever it's called! If it smells like a foot, you better put it in my mouth! Shit! That sounded wrong! Maybe he's not really All Might's successor. 
Hey, Deku, nice outfit. Thanks, Kachan. But I think it would look better on the floor. What? You're still in it. It's just that you're on the floor while there's a little chalk circle drawn around your dead body. Oh, thank God. You just want to kill me. For a second, I thought you were going to say something NSFW. <laughs> 